With the indulgence of our colleagues and our resource persons, I have a very brief opening statement. I, I believe I owe it to my colleagues and those watching this proceeding this morning that I make a disclosure para lang malinaw where I'm coming from when I propound my questions later. Having said that, I would like to stress that having come from the ranks of the police, I know and understand their psyche. I know their frustrations over a flawed judicial system with unsympathetic, sometimes corrupt prosecutors. Kapisado ko na rin ang mga palusot at mga kalokohan ng mga eskaliwag sa hanay nila. May mga tinanggal nga ako sa serbisyo ng GPNP pa ako na nagsipagbalikan nung wala na ako. At ginamit pa nila para gipitin ako at gipitin din ang mga dati kong tauhan na malalapit sa akin. I know as well their enthusiasm and dedication to perform their duties in order to accomplish their assigned mission. I have openly and consistently manifested my misgivings to allow this inquiry to proceed. And for good reasons. Number one, the momentum that the police has gained over a short period through life-risking work of fighting illegal drugs must not be deterred by legislative inquiries like what we are conducting right now. Frankly, I have never seen anything on the scale of the current anti-illegal drugs campaign under this administration. Number two, as I had spent almost half of my life in law enforcement like them, I am not sure how many times I could have been maimed or killed by enemy fire during police operations that I had participated in, or the number of times I could have landed in jail while performing my duties as a law enforcer. Number three, nakaharap na rin po ako sa ganitong uri ng legislative investigation and be seated on their side of a committee room. And I can tell you, the feeling was anything but pleasant. Never akong nakaramdam ng good vibes noon. I just hope our resource persons who are members of the police force are not talking to themselves now as I speak, cursing us legislators the way I did then. To our police officers present in this inquiry, honestly, I don't know how this whole exercise of drug fighting will end. I have no idea what is the end state of all your efforts. All I want to pick, and I want to pick your brain on that later. I can only make a guess. Either we have a drug-free Philippines after six months, or maybe a longer period, or, God forbid, you go bust and worse, end up in jail. Thank you, Madam Chair.